Hello. This is one of the scams called I fell in love with you scam. Once you discover that the scammer is not who they say they are, the um, say the picture who they are, the details who they say they are, um, and you discover that um, it's all been a lie, uh, the scammer comes back to you after you've um, realised you've been busted and says, hey, you know, um, I'm sorry for what I've done. Um, this is the real photo of me, or this is the real picture, and they do go on instant message then um, with the same voice, character, all that sort of stuff. And they do the, well, I'm sorry, but as we went on, I did fall in love with you. Um, you know, they, as I said, they apologise for all the bullshit they've been feeding you for a period of time, the money they've taken. Now they say they fall in love with you after scamming you and ripping you off of your money and emotions and tricking your mind that this other photo was them. Um, the problem is that when they fall in love with you is, is another part of the scam. And I don't know if you can understand how they do it. It's all fake, if you can see that. Um, a fake computer. Um, fake gifts. Suitcase, ready to see them. Browsing, looking for them. Portfolios and files and recycle bins. So what they do is start up a whole lot of rubbish again, trying to scam you um, in a different way that they say they fell in love with you. Now they need your money to um, come and see you again. So they're trying to get more money again out of you from re-scamming. Um, in a different way and some people fall for this but it's the um, I fell in love with you scam and um, it's very insulting how they do it but that's the I fell in love with you scam after they've scammed you and you discover that they're not that photo but they're someone else so you really want to fall in love with um, the new person but they're, they're scamming you again does that make sense